Here we go, live reaction. Live reaction, yeah. So this is the Chocolate Smiths with incredibly well packaged chocolate bars. Yeah, I love it. They are literally how Charlie and the Chocolate... Yeah, Wonka-esque. Uh, yeah, Wonka-esque bars Factory, in, yeah. are meant to be, basically. Um, incredible. Proudly handmade in Northumbria. And we've got oh, sensational flavours. Bubblegum Sunday, Vanilla bubblegum and white chocolate. We've got maple bacon, maple syrup bacon and butterscotch milk and white chocolate. And... Come back for those guys. That's... Banana toffee bread. And... and did we buy these or were they no, sent to us? I reached out to um, the chocolate smith. Actually, tell a lie, I basically saw a good friend of the podcast, Kelly, uh, go and check out Maverick Baking now. She, I think, liked or shared or did something on one of their, their uh, Instagram posts. I went over there, saw these really weird, quirky flavours. And I think it was the bacon one caught my eye and I commented on it saying, this looks amazing. And they messaged us and said we would be happy to send you some, as well as a couple of other flavours. I cannot wait. So. But you'll have to wait for those two. Roll credits! Hi guys, and welcome to Food Review UK. My name is Nate. My name is Gossie. My name is Andre. Uh, and if you, I don't know if Emdo's put it in the beginning of this video, but anyway, we have got a bar from the Chocolate Smiths, um, who very kindly sent us this and two other flavours, which we will come to in another video. This first one that we're going to try, though, is banana toffee bread and milk chocolate. Um, their range of bizarre flavours, and this is... The most normal of the three. Oh out. yeah, I would say it's not that bizarre because I think I've got a feeling it'll be. Well, in my head, my, I perceive. I basically perceive. I basically perceive. I basically perceive. I basically perceive it to be a white chocolate bar with like a hint of banana to it, which I think is uh, not. Well, I don't want to disrespect the company, but fairly easy, straightforward to pull off. I would imagine if you know, I could see other companies producing similar things. That sort of thing, but. There are other flavours unheard of, like, so mm. they, they they're have, certainly more exciting. The bacon one was, oh. it, although it is milk chocolate. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I thought you said white chocolate. No, this one. Oh, this one's sorry, milk apologies. Um, but, like, because actually, obviously, as you can see from the packaging, it is like the sort of colour of white, white chocolate, chocolate would be. Yeah, yeah. And also, I think it would be quite easy to do white chocolate yeah, with banana flavours. Like but um, don't, don't apologise, just, just, just get it right. Oh wow, I think it actually has... Oh fuck. Banana toffee bread. I will, you probably will anyway, but can I just say one thing is, um, just try... Yeah. Should I get a plate? Me to help out. Yeah. I'll get a plate just because... Yeah, probably you don't want chocolate on the carpet. Maybe. Yeah, essentially, because, uh, yeah, well, uh, well, I'll say anything. Well, it's probably going to be melting by the time. So let's show a little bit on fuck MJ, because he's going to have to see fingers. Oh, there it is. Already there, mate. Good lad. Like I say, I fully trust you, but um, yeah, at the same time. Well, you can say that. No, I'm joking, I do trust you. Oh, well, just... you just brought out one plate. Mm. Well, that makes sense, because we're not all eating chocolate, are we? Shall we all just sit around there? <coughs> wow. Yeah, this one is pathetic. Around? What was the point of bringing out a plate, mate? Wow. I'll tell you what. It's a bit rude. So, what's this going in, sorry? Um, so, this is banana toffee bread, and what else? Is the, what's the other thing in it? There was something else in it. Or was it just that? Uh, no, it was banana toffee bread and uh, milk chocolate. Alright. I've had banana chocolate before, actually. I think I've. Didn't we do it? Was mm. it no? Yeah, no. Yeah, correct. Oh, wow, that is banana y. Yeah. Incredibly so. Wow. Oh. It's very rich, like the bourbon banana, if that even makes sense. Yeah, there's something um, got... caramelised yeah. about that. Yeah. Um, like... Wow. There are bits in there as well. Yeah, but that isn't even so. You would still think that the chocolate was a strong enough flavour to really just kick it right in the nuts and tell it to fuck off. Yeah, tell it to fuck off, man. It's a very technical food term. I don't know if you've heard that one before. <laughs> I just thought the uh, I just thought the <laughs> <laughs> I just thought the uh, chocolate, you know, that would uh, you know kick it in the nuts and tell it to fuck off. <laughs> amazing, <laughs> amazing. Hmm. 
You wouldn't get this on other channels. No. It would be much better. I just spilled the chocolate material. You can make sure they see the product. Cook the, cook the banana in the box and turn it the fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, so. Mm. We've recently been criticised for not showing the products. So sorry that we've got too much personality for you. <laughs> what are the little, um. They're little button buttons. bits. They're little buttons. chocolate buttons, I think, yeah. Mmm. Well, like okay. actual banana in there. It's not banana, just banana flavouring. There is banana in there. Should I break up some more? Which also, <coughs> which also gives it added texture. It's not yeah. just a chocolate bar. The texture of this this stuff, I don't know what it is. Like the sugary, pasty, like almost like hard fudge or tablet. Can I just say as well, obviously, this not being a big brand or anything like that, you always worry what the chocolate quality is going to be like. Yeah. Mm. It's great though. It's actually really good chocolate. It's really creamy. Mm. It's, got, it's got a really nice texture to it. Yeah, snap, like tempered sort but of But at the snap. same time, it's sort of quite melt in the mouth. Mm. Now I know we're going to get the whole comments about, oh, they sent you the free products, and obviously you're going to like, genuinely. So no, I'll be fair. I'll yeah. be fair. If that, if that other bar doesn't taste like bacon. Yeah. And then that, that I think when you're, when you're claiming to do something that outlandish, you've got to deliver. Yeah, they did pre-warn me and say that it was mild, but... Ooh. Okay. I will say time. as well, for anyone who says that, oh, they sent it to you, whatever, just have a look at our Zio reviews, yeah? Because that is a shit product, and they sent that to us. Correct. Um, they won't send us any more, but... Banana and chocolate is not that necessarily... <laughs> banana and chocolate is not necessarily two flavours that you would necessarily put together, but at the same time... I mean, I've never it, had a chocolate dipped banana. I haven't. Come. So, really good product. Really good product. Tasty. Innovative. What's going on here between you two? Hatred. Pure, unadulterated hatred. Wow. Um. Really, really, really nice. I, I, I am going to go. Yeah. Just, just the jollies. I don't need any more. But that is that is lovely. That is lovely. Um. They've done very well. They can be proud of that because that is uh, <coughs> nothing like a chocolate bar I've ever had before right. in my life. Never. I like um, the little bits in it. Yeah, great texture. It's not. It's not even just a chocolate bar that has quirky flavours. That is a whole new product. That is a hybrid. <laughs> that is a fusion of products. There is actual fruit in that bar. There is a. There is banana in that chocolate bar. That is what? great. Simple. simple. Test for these products that we get sent would buy. Sim yeah. Simply, simply put. Oh God! Yeah. You know, price point excluded. Do, you, do we know what the price point is? Um, oh, actually, I should have looked at that. I'll look at that for the next video. I think they're two quid a bar. So come back for the next video to find out how much this two is. Two quid a bar. I, I think so because I, I think I, they're I, massively I, pricey. Yeah. I've looked I think we need time. to really look it up now. We're doing it by no, the no, way. Let them come back for the other video. Oh yeah, actually, no, we're not. We're specifically not. We're specifically yeah, going to absolutely prevent. not telling. Why we're going to compromise the quality of this video in order to make you watch the next video? Mm. To be honest, you should watch the other videos because the other flavours are even crazier than this. So, and because we're <coughs> reviewing them, and um, score. We're great. Sorry, can you help Claire's upstairs? Sorry, can you help me with the PS3 and bring me a cheeky drink of water? It says a system software update is required. I don't know what to do. I'm useless. Incorrect. You're the love of my life. You're not reading Aww. your messages. Uh, weird sort of face emoji. Sad face. Sad face. Yeah. You called? Dot 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 Weird emoji again. Hello. Fine. Just fine. Oh. That's what I've said. Go and tend to your wife. Do you want me to go and tend to her? Absolutely. Does she like banana chocolate? Would she like a piece she of She doesn't like banana. One of the few things she doesn't like. So, uh, Let it hit first. High four stars. <clears throat> yeah, I was actually thinking that as well. Yeah. I was I was thinking about a low five. Yeah. I was I was toying with the two. I think I'm gonna go high four because banana isn't necessarily a flavour that I'm hugely about. But at the same time, considering that high four's a good score for me, so I'm gonna go high four. I think that that's a chocolate bar that's going to live long in my memory, and for that, you get my five. Good play. Really. It deserves a five. It's a five star product. I don't know what we do from here because they've both gone. Technically, the video's still going on. Yeah. Um,
I mean, just... Huh? Thank you all for watching. Um, please let us know if you have tried Chocolate Smiths or if this product interests you. People sometimes ask me, they, they'll say in the comments, they'll say, oh, what is a fat beast like you doing with a lovely girl like Claire? Um, it's because I'm a kind, sensitive, attentive, modest, arrogant man who recognises some of his flaws, very few flaws. Thank you very much for watching. Food. One of one of your flaws being the fact that you that you make up words like attentive. <laughs> Is it attentive? Yeah. Yeah. I've got good vocabulary for watching Food Review UK. <laughs> <laughs> Check us out on Facebook. Check out Shopsmiths at, at co.ucom. <laughs> Check out the chocolate smiths. Uh, I don't know what their website is, but you can find them on Instagram. They are very active over there, and they have a wide range of flavors. Do they? Yeah, yeah. Not just the free. No, 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 no. They've oh. got loads of flavors, and they do seasonal ones. They wow. Do, like, there was there was one um, there was one coming up on fire night, which was like it was. I'm sure it's called like fireworks or something like that. And they had like popping candy and smoky, smoky shit and gunpowder. Yeah. See you later, guys. <laughs>